Hello, it's me, your boy, Jordan. Today, I'm going to do a how to play uh, Kate McCannon by Colter Wall. Except there's a whole bunch of them on the internet, so... Um, and they're all going to be better than this, by the way. So I'm just going to do a very easy one, because um, all of those are quite true to the original. Um, Colter Wall, incredible guitarist, incredible singer, incredible songwriter. Um, me, not so much. Uh, so this is the easy version for those who probably are not as good as Colter Wall, which is most of us. So if you want to play an easy version of the song, this is the video for you. Um, and then I also recommend checking out a whole bunch of uh, actual videos where you, th they show you how to play the actual song. Um, I'll pop a link to my video where I sing this song in uh, here. I don't know where they go. Um, anyways, uh, Cole to Wall plays the song uh, in, gee whiz, uh, B flat minor. Um, so that is, if you put the capo on the first fret, uh, I prefer it in A minor, um, so I just don't use a capo. You can use a capo if you want. Uh, he has very low register, uh, so it will probably help. Um, most people will probably be able to play it uh, capo 4. Um, you can sing along to it if you want. Um, I also have a low singing register for some reason, so um, I prefer to play it with no capo, but, you know, each to their own. Also, excuse me, my eye is quite itchy. Anyways, the introduction, so it, it's a ballad, it's a murder ballad, so the, it's the same through and through, except there's a little bit later on. Um, but, you know, I'm going to be playing an abridged, abbreviated version. Uh, and it's going to be more accessible for a lot of people. So here you go. Um, he doesn't play it like this. So, you know, it's not going to sound exactly the same. That's because it's not the same. Anyways, the pattern goes to A minor. Okay, so A minor. And then there's a picking pattern. So the little dun dun, so it's a little step up, so A minor, and then you just kind of mess around on the A minor, and then you go play the E, open E, and then you, on the third fret, with your little pinky finger, uh, sorry, ring finger, you can use your middle finger if you want, but then you're going to go back to the A minor, so I prefer this, so... So you don't have to do that, you don't have to do finger picking, you can go... So the top string is quite accessible if you're picking with an actual pick. Um, that's why this, yeah, this is probably the best way to do it. So um, I'll play it really slowly with the finger picking version. So, and you can kind of do that however many times you want to. Um, just remember on the one before you start singing, um, stop playing the, uh, don't do the step. So, yeah, so. bird his wings are black as sin so that's how it goes so I don't know if you heard then but just before I started singing I didn't do that um, but you can do that if you want uh, it's hard so up to you so I'll play it really slowly and Minor 
is a wicked bird. His wings are black as sin. Okay, so, and now I'll go through the words. Also, importantly, sorry, I should have said this right at the start, but the chords are pretty much A minor, G, A minor, and then there's a C and a D minor, and then a G. Um, those are the chords, A minor, D, oh, sorry, A minor, G, C, and D minor. I play the G, so this is the A minor, obviously, everyone knows how to play an A minor. I play the G, not like this, but you can, and for some people it will sound better, so that's a normal G with your G on C chord, sorry. Um, but I find it easier to play the G like this. So, it's kind of like a C chord, that's a C, but it's just one up. It makes it very easy to transition from A minor, C, G, all those three chords, because they're the most common. So it goes. So that's, that was A minor, G, A minor. So anyways, um, I'll sing the lyrics slowly in time with the chord transition, because uh, I find that helps me. Um, so hopefully that helps you. So. Well, the raven is a wicked bird, his wings are black as sin. And he floats outside my prison window, mocking those within. That little bit goes. Well, the raven is a wicked bird, his wings are black as sin. He floats outside my prison window, mocking those within so very pretty simple anyways the next bit is and he sings to me real low C D minor it's hell to where you'll go G C um, so I'll play it again and he sings to me real low it's hell to where you'll go and then it goes for you did murder Kate McCannon. And then there's a little bit of a pause, and then it goes the uh, G, A minor. So I'll do the whole chorus verse, I mean the whole bit, because then hopefully it's easier to understand. So. Um. Well, the raven is a wicked bird. His wings are black as sin And he floats outside my prison window Mocking those within And he sings to me real low It's hell to where you go For you did murder Kate McCannon So um, around one of the G's, it has a bunch of C's and stuff in one of the chord charts. Just ignore them. Just play the G. I mean, sorry, G and C. It's, a, it's just a C. Sorry. Um, there's also yeah. Any instrumental break, just play this. So the next verse, the exact same. So. When I first met Tom McCannon, I was working in the mines. Said he had himself a dark-haired daughter with long green eyes. When she and I did meet, she was bathing in the creek. So just play the C, don't play the G and then the C again. Prettiest girl in the whole damn holler, that ain't no lie. There's an A minor again, uh, it's not there on the chords for some reason, so I do apologise. I'll play that again slowly. When I first met Tom McCannon, I was working in the mines. Said he had himself a dark haired daughter with long green eyes. When she and I did meet, she was bathing in the creek. 
prettiest girl in the whole damn holler that ain't no lie however you want to play it all right so the third verse i'll just do the the next verse quite slowly uh again so i went courting kate mccannon got me a job and i quit my rambling and every day i'd say a quarter of my pay ignore the G and the C so I could buy a diamond ring next verse Lord one day I come home to find my darling angels not inside so I made for the creek where she and I did meet and found her with some other lover so then this is kind of you can almost do whatever you want here so then there's a so there's a build up and it goes whatever you want to do just play things and get louder and then he goes and I three rounds into Kate McCannon and then it goes so just and I put three rounds into Kate McCannon G A minor anyways um, look it's probably not that helpful um, but if you want uh, you know I've got that video that you can watch and it's just it's the same old uh, it's the same chords over and over again through the whole ballad. So I'll play it one more time. Uh, the chord process. Well, the raven is a wicked bird. His wings are black as sin. And he floats outside my prison window, mocking those within. And he sings to me real low It's hell to where you go For you did murder Kate McCannon So yeah, um, the last line of each verse I like to kind of stop and then go back to the A minor Anyways, um let me know if you'd like me to do another song for you. Um, let me know if you like this one. It's okay if you didn't. Let me know if you didn't like it. Um, yeah, I hope that helps you learn uh, this song. It's a great song. I think murder ballads really need to come back because they're just bangers. Uh, Johnny Cash, uh, Colter Wall, great at murder ballads. Anyways, thank you for listening. Uh, I hope you enjoyed.